Hey, what's up friends? Today, we're gonna do some flying. And if you watched my last video, you know I've been getting into FPV drone flying. Yeah, I bought the DJI Avada. My first flight didn't go so well, uh, but I think I've got all the kinks worked out. I've been practicing some more. Got all the settings I need turned on and the ones that I don't need turned off so I can fly in manual mode without any limitations. So today we're gonna be doing some more flying and hopefully it goes better and we don't crash. We will see. I believe I can fly, woo, let's go. So I'm going to be flying at this school, which has some obstacles that I can try to fly through and do some tricks and all that good jazz. And thankfully it's Saturday, so nobody's here. Otherwise I wouldn't do it because I don't want to fly over people, especially kids, because that's a little strange. So uh, yeah, we're here, going to get set up and uh, go fly. So let's do it. It's a pretty chilly day here in uh, Texas, which is where I live. and. Actually, today is the least windy day we've had since I, I bought the Avada pretty much. So I'm glad there's not any wind. I'll have to, I mean, there's a little bit of wind, but not not bad. But I've been having to fight the wind every time I try to fly. So yeah, it should be good. So let's uh, go ahead and I'm gonna get started. Well, uh, 30 seconds in, I had my first crash and the battery fell out, so that's no good. Uh, I'll show you this. There's the battery and there's the drone. I'm trying to power loop and, uh, you know, that's what I get. The drone looks fine though. I'm gonna plug the battery in and give it another shot. Well, now I seem to have gotten my drone stuck in a tree. Um, great, great flying there, buddy. I was trying to do a little tricky trick over the thing and let me show you where the drone is. See up there? It's a pretty big tree. Uh, that'd be fun to get down, but I'll, I'm gonna find a way. 20 minutes later. I got it, guys. I got it. I tried a couple of things. I tried to throw a water bottle at it. Didn't get it. So I shook the tree branch as hard as I could and it fell down and you know what? It's still flyable, so I'm gonna go fly it. <laughs> thank you, thank you for the support, guys.
guys that was a lot of fun you know besides getting stuck in a tree and crashing it like 20 times it's a great day a lot of fun ripping around the playgrounds and do some tricks uh, learning what the dji avada can and can't do or at least what i can and can't do with the dji avada uh, but thankfully this thing's built like a tank and didn't sustain any damage besides a few scratches but no big deal and um one thing i really am thankful for is dji's care refresh it's not sponsored or anything but um i can fly this thing without really worrying about crashing it or losing it which is awesome if i crash it it's like 29 bucks to get a, a brand new one if it gets broken and um if you lose it, it's like i think 200 dollars. but gives you that peace of mind which uh, you know at fpv you don't really have that if you're building your own quads i mean yeah you can repair it but you know it costs time and money so um yeah, thankful for the thing. This thing's also built like a tank because for somebody who's not super experienced with flying real FPV, except in a simulator, uh, this thing's awesome. <clears throat> awesome, excuse me. So I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, smash the like button and subscribe and all that junk. You know what to do. But appreciate you guys watching. Talk to you later. You got CE Tech.